Why did they put like the nastiest fucking filter they possibly could on that intro? Why did they dull all their colors? That's you shouldn't do that. This is JoJo. JoJo is colorful. That was kind of lame. <laughs> well, anyways, welcome, man, machine, everything in between, to JoJo's Bizarre Adventures All Star Battle. Uh, R. I get. I was about to call it All Star Battle Royale. Jesus fuck. That's how far have we made it. So this game originally came out. What in I want to say ooh, 2012, right? I have the original game on the PS3. Fun fact I actually did a playthrough of it years ago and then I deleted that playthrough from my YouTube channel because I didn't like it. <laughs> but now the game has gotten a re release, surprisingly. All this dumb shit right here, and along with the re release. It also, oh my fucking god. Yes, I will sell my soul to you. Leave me alone. Um, also, what the, what the fucking, stop. <laughs> also, with the re-release, they did a complete rework of the game and added in a bunch of characters. Right off the bat here, are we doing a tutorial? Because they didn't have that in the original. Honestly, when the first game came out, well, when the first game, when this game initially came out, oh yeah, it's a tutorial. They didn't have this in the original. Oh shit, I don't remember them having this. One of the biggest uh, problems for uh, All Star Battle when it came out was that nobody knew how to play the game, right? Because it was weird. The game wasn't sure if it wanted to be 2D or 3D or whatever, and there was a bunch of fun JoJo mechanics they did. <laughs> And no one knew what to do, and the game wasn't balanced, and it was it, it wasn't good for a fighting game, but it was fun for a game, right? All right, input direction forward, backward, crouch. All right, weak, medium, strong, dodge. Dodge now has a dedicated button, because I don't remember that having a dedicated button before. Style assist. We have assist now. That's new. When you hit square, keep pressing it. Oh, this is the easy beat system. One of the uh. I want to say it's one of the first games to incorporate it, right? One of the first fighting games to incorporate Easy Beat, right? Um, I mean, this did it, Persona did it, and I want to say Blaze Blue did it first. I want to say those three games were the kind of the first games to incorporate just smash the square button, right? Okay. got our supers I remember the heat gauge you have different styles for uh, for characters right you have the Hamon style the stand style uh, the rider style and oh right off the bat right off the bat it feels way better oh they did have a dedicated dodge button before I remember this yeah okay right Ooh. all right just like, okay, hold up, wait a minute, hold up, hold up, Zapelli. Give me a moment here. They changed a lot right off the bat. Because now they have directional inputs. I don't remember that being a thing before. I remember Zoom Punch, right? I remember Zoom Punch being, um, like a full ass, like, super input you had to put in, right? All right, so, oh my god, what is the dead zone on this? I'm playing this on the PS5, by the way, I want to point that out. And maybe, <laughs> I just want to make sure that the dead zone on my analog stick isn't fucked, and maybe that's why I'm just throwing out zoom punches like it's no one's business, right? So the thing I'm probably most excited about with this is that, oh god, yeah, yeah, okay, huh. That might just be, yep, that's definitely an analog stick problem. Either that or, hold up, does that linger? Forward. Oh, man. That's weird. There's like a opening window for that. Like, instead of it being just like, 
press the two inputs at once, right? I'm pressing, you know, I'm pressing forward and punch, right? But you can also just tap forward and punch, and there's still, like, a window for it to still go? It's so weird. Okay. Maybe I can fix that later. So, this is what? Heavy? That's medium. That's him on breathing. Okay. And if I get to level 2... Stop throwing your wine at me for like two seconds, thank you. Alright. Okay. I'm definitely gonna have to play around with this. Definitely gonna have to play around with this. And of course you got the poses, right? I think there's like a uh, in-game shop where you can change the victory poses you get. <laughs> Alright, that's all the tutorial battles. There's definitely way more than this. There's definitely like a, a JoJo, like a style dodge mechanic, right? 3D model viewer. Extra costumes. Yeah, this is all the pre-order stuff. And they also got a uh, Seasons Pass, which of course I bought because, I mean, I love JoJo. Been loving JoJo since, like, what, 2006, I want to say? Right? I remember when Part 8 came out. What was that, 2011? <laughs> and then this game came out, and they were like, yep, this game's not finished because we're still working on Part 8. Uh-huh. Online's gonna be freaky and still might be unbalanced as shit. So, first of all, let's head to Versus. Because I want to see the new characters that they threw in here. You have your one-on-ones, right? Team battle, which is... I think it's new, right? Knockout style. In total points, you fight three battles. Each character... One team, more victory. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So... And in tournament style. So... Oh my god. Fucking... <laughs> so, there's definitely going to be way more... Love towards the manga readers here, right? With that said, I'm going to be fully honest... Since I was waiting for part 8 to be finished, I never read part 8, right? I've only finished part 7, and even right now, I'm rereading part 7 because it's been so long since I've read it. But, uh, that dude right there, that guy, and his fucking watch. <laughs> he had a, a fun backstory, and by fun, I mean pretty fucked up, right? Alright, so rounds, let's go just for one, right? Infinite time, normal difficulty. Shut up, Ringo. Right. So, what new characters do we have here? Right. Of course, you got, you know... Was Iggy in the original? No, Iggy was DLC in the original. Yes. Um, Okiasu. I would have loved that they put Okiasu's brother in here in Bad Company and kind of worked that in there. Bruno was, the, was in the original. Uh, Mista is new. Mista wasn't in the original. Uh... Artemis, was she playable in there? No, I don't think she was playable. I don't think she was playable in the original, but I'm pretty sure she had a character model and she showed up in one of Jolene's specials. Johnny was definitely there. Johnny and Tusk. Uh, these two motherfuckers. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea what the deal with this guy is, but, you know, he's in part 8, so I can't wait to read that. Foo Fighters is new for this game, 100%. Gyro was there. Diavolo, this was back when, um, when everyone still didn't understand what King... What the fuck? My bad. That's not Diavolo. Ooh, I'm so sorry. I forgot. I forgot. This was also during the time where certain color palettes weren't confirmed for characters, right? Because JoJo is notorious for constantly changing the, uh, the colors on, like, um you know, the uh, cover art of the manga and stuff like that. My bad. My bad. This is Homeboy and Diver Down. I'm not going to talk too much about him because Part 6 just, uh, Part 6 Season 2 just came out, right? Trish is new. She wasn't in the original. Uh, same thing with Narencia. Part 4, Jotaro, was he in the original? I think he might have been DLC. Okay, Yukako, I think she wasn't in the original. 
Rohan and, of course, Koichi were there. Mariah, she might have been DLC. I don't remember. I think she's new. Uh, Lisa Lisa was there. Of course, the Pillarmen, right? Whole Horse. I don't think... Mm, I don't think Whole Horse was in the original. He might have been DLC. Might have. Pet Shop. Hold up. I just realized something. They didn't rename the characters. Because there was, there was this weird thing, right? Kind of like how Mega Man does it, right? Where, uh, you know how... What, what is it? Mega Man X4, I want to say? No, 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 no. Was it X5 or 6? One of them? Where, like, certain Robot Masters were named after bands like Duff McMcWhaling and all that shit, right? So you had a lot of things with JoJo, you know, since a lot of stands and a lot of stands and characters are named after, uh, you know, bands and celebrities and stuff like that. So Pet Shop for a while used to be called Animal Shop, but we still have Cool Ice here instead of Vanilla Ice, which is really fun because since they have the Japanese dialogue in here, whenever he says his name or whatever, you just hear him say Vanilla Ice in the most English way possible, right? Akira and Red Hot Chili Peppers, right? I know, um, uh, fucking, why can't I say his name? For some reason, it's skipping my brain right now. It's right there in front of me, but I can't say it for some reason. Um, he was in, uh, he was a DLC character. Pesci and, uh, <laughs> and his Anaki are new, right? He's new. I can never pronounce his name. I believe his stand's name is uh, White Album, though. Diavolo. That's where I was getting to. Fucking. It was during the time where no one still knew how his stand worked, which I never understood. Because I always explain it to people like, guys, he's literally just a video editor. That's all he does. Like, imagine you edit it, a giant part of a video, and then you cut it out, right? That doesn't change the fact that you edit it, and it doesn't change the fact that what's going to happen next is going to happen. Right? And that's pretty much how King Crimson worked. People didn't get it, for some reason. But but the anime finally cleared it up for people, I guess. It used to be a joke. What does, Crim what does King Crimson actually do? What does it mean by alter reality? There's Poochie, right? Funny Valentine Part 7. And Diego Brando. I think he's new. He might have been DLC in the original. I'm not sure. There was a lot of DLC characters in the original, but I think he's new. I don't remember Diego Brando being in this one. I remember Part 7 characters only being Funny Valentine, Gyro Zapelli, and Johnny Joestar. Alright. So this is fun, right? Now, I actually want to... While I'm sitting here... By the way, <laughs> if you're here and you're just like... You're like, just get, just get to the game already. Stop talking, right? Listen, I'm a JoJo fan, and there's something that JoJo fans like to do. We like to talk. Um, I'm gonna put UZB on because I just want to know what the hell's going on. Assess. Okay. Trap. Rush attack. Trap. Anti ear. Okay. Shooting. Shooting. What are you gonna do? You're fucking like. Your finger pistol thing that you only use a total of once throughout the series, Jotaro, you fucking loser. Tricky? What the fuck? Long range attack. I think old Joseph Joestar might have been DLC, I'm not sure. Iggy, are you long range? Rush attack. Trap. Rush. Hmm. Let's just throw a whole horse in You know what, actually? Because it's JoJo, and we want to listen to some of these character quotes, I guess. Jolene. There we go. And as for... Sure. Let's have you in, uh... Where's the original Dio? There he is. Down here. It's all color-coded. Oh, do we have any new stages? Dio's castle is there. The battlefield. Dio's mansion. Uh, the city, Cairo Bridge, Cape, <laughs> Cape Boingy Boing, that's from, that's from part four. I mean, it says it right there, but <laughs> it's been a while. Kira's Estate, 
Rome. Huh. I don't know why some of these are grayed out for some reason. You cannot select this arena. Why not? In versus mode, characters with stone mask icons cannot be used in arenas. Once you complete the boss panel of the part where such a character appears in all-star battle mode, that character will be unlocked to play in all arenas. Ooh, really? Okay. Everglades. Oh, Everglades is where they fought Foo Fighters. Okay. I was confused from <laughs> the frogs. Right? Steel Ball Run. This is the Dino Village. Yep, the Dino Village. Uh, Philadelphia Seaside. That's part 7, of course. And Wall's Eyes is part 8, which I don't know shit about. Right? Uh, let's head to the Coliseum. Gimmicks on, right? I love Foo Fighters. I was hoping to get like some uh Get your luck and fuck shit. Oh my god, that's very short range. I'm not used to that being so fucking short. Okay. So the gimmicks activate when your opponent or you are in like a knockdown state on like that red circle, right? Oh shit, I gotta get out the way. Oh uh, fuck. I spot dodged that shit. Alright. Trying to figure out. I myself, when I play fighting games, I like to figure out shit myself, right? Rather than just look at the, uh. Oh, he fucking. He style dodged my shit. Okay, nice. Fuck that. Ugh. Killing you from inside. With all the little shrimps. Memories give myself courage. What the fuck? That's such a plan ass quote. Alright. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna head to, uh, let me see, I'm actually gonna head straight to training, right, practice mode. Set up computer plays the way you want them, blah, 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 all right, let's see, I wanna see, actually, I wanna see what they do for Trish, because... Here's the thing about Trish, which is very funny to me, right? I know exactly what I'm doing. I'll make sure you talk no matter what. Arrivederci. <laughs> Easy Beat's gonna be on, of course. Because I'm still learning shit. I gotta relearn JoJo, right? And it doesn't matter. I guess it does. Now, hold up. I want to see Nancy's model. And Mista. I just realized Fugo's not in this game. Hold up, wait a minute. Oh wait, no, there he is. Yeah, Fugo wasn't uh, playable. He was DLC. He was definitely DLC before. He was definitely DLC before. I remember that much. Fugo, the most, <laughs> the most broken character, so broken that they had to make him walk out of the story. <laughs> because it's like, if he just hits you once, you're dead. There's no fight in that guy, right? And then they did like a, uh, and then they did a, um, whatchamacallit, a spinoff series, I believe, of him like coming back into the gang. Alright. 
uh, stand, damage display off, doesn't matter, display type off, auto guard off, auto down evasion, down evasion, okay, heat gauge normal, assist on, assist setting, blah blah, counter strike, right, okay, I want to know what they do for Trish, because in the, in the manga, and even in the show, she doesn't really do much, like, Spice Lady. Spice Lady. <laughs> Spice Lady. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Uh, option settings real quick. Uh, where is... Because it distracts the ever-living shit out of me, and I hate looking at it every single time. Control guide. Right? No, that's not it. Wait, it was control god. I just didn't confirm it. Alright. Fucking spice lady. You mean spice girls? Yeah, so her ability is like just she hits things and she makes them elastic? Soft? I don't know. She can Hmm. They kinda do the same thing with uh with Josuke in part eight. Right? Because his stand ability is that he can take away concepts. Spice Lady. Comboable. I wish they had like a better descriptor than just the name of the move. Uh, something soft is even more breakable than diamond. Fucking, we got Shoryu motions. That's amazing. Make any material soft. Two attack buttons, really. Wait, that's a fuck. Hold up, that was. All right, all right, see. Start fucking, start swinging at me, buddy. Or two stand now. Uh, I guess computer, right? Right. Ooh. All right. Way to fuck me up, Narencia. I'm trying to see how that works, because it looks like it's supposed to be a counter hit. What is the input for that? Let me see. Come on. Is that not like a... Damn, dude. Wait, so what the fuck does that do? Consumes he's good to use while guarding. It's chargeable. If used while guard... What the... Oh, okay, it reflects shit. Okay, that's what it does. That's cool. Let me guess, friend or foe is him releasing his toxic gas. Get the fuck out of here, Mista. Go shoot yourself. <laughs> Did you know that Mista was shooting himself every five hours? Fuck it, come on. All right, I hate Shoryu motions. I hate them so much. What is that, an anti-air? All right, you can... That fucking spot dodge. Get him to yourself, wannabe. Oh, stand mode and... Oh. I was so fucking confused. Okay. When opponent is down. What the fucking fuck? User mode, stand mode. Is there a... Oh, I see. Okay, yes. Alright. Ah. 
I completely forgot that you can do like a sta a fucking uh stance switch. All right, hold up, Nancia. I need you to like come the fuck down for like two seconds, my girl. Just stand there, looking all beautiful. Okay. That's not what I wanted to do. Stand mode. Okay. <laughs> I turned it soft. That's what she said. Nobody's get taken out today. What is that like a command grab? What the fuck is that? All right, it's a hard knockdown. Ooh. Okay. That's definitely an anti-air. Now I'm trying to remember rumble mode. Yeah, that's like a Hmm. I got to hit you one more time. Okay, so that's just like a regular super, right? An easy beat goes straight into it. I'm trying to remember if like... Oh, you know what? Instead of doing that... I'm trying to build up meter. Instead of doing that, right? Just... Yeah, just have it at max all the time. Alright. Wannabe is her super. They just made her like punchy girl, really. Which is so weird because she's not punchy girl. <laughs> you know what I mean? Jolene is the closest thing to punchy girl. <laughs> but instead of punchy, she's kicky. Okay, when opponent is down. So like he is right now. Or I can, you know, make you go down. What the fuck? Oh, it's diagonal. Okay, that's what it is. What the fuck? You just straight up stab him while he's down? That's just it? Ugh. <laughs> With the pole from the fucking plane. Notorious B.I.G. style. Uh, is that all she's rocking with? I want to know what that fucking, like... Oh, it's a throw. That's how you activate it. It looked like a... That's such a weird animation for a throw. Because that looks like it's supposed to be a counter hit. I would expect it to be a counter hit too, you know, considering her ability. Alright, well that's pretty much it for Trish, right? Jesus. They went just kind of like a basic route with her. They're like, ah, uh, she has a, she has a stand, it can kind of punch, just do some punchy shit. Everyone can oda oda their way through it, right? Um, let's see, actually, this should be interesting, because your stand is, you know, your fucking weird ice skate shit. <laughs> it's so weird that, uh... Oh, well, he's not the only assassin here because you Why didn't they put Metallica in here? That would have been so fun. He might be DLC. He might be, uh... He might be a, uh... You know... Might be a season pass character. Right?
Uh, where's the, uh... I thought there was, like, a random button. Alright. Oh my god. Run speed's kind of slow. I'm guessing that gets better with your skates. Yeah, that definitely does. Okay. So what do you do? Rip you apart. Use during attack. Oh, that's an assist. My bad. Okay, basic throw. Do I hold that? Hmm. Oh, there goes Foo Fighters. <laughs> my water! Take it away from my water, that's mine! Ugh! <laughs> Is like, on the oh my god, the Sex Pistols just fucking scream Mista? Shut the fuck up, oh my god. Hold up. I just saw a Mista get like... Oh, I guess that might have been uh, Foo Fighters, like, just making him spaz on the floor. You want to skate? What the fuck is that animation? Just lay down and punch him straight in the dick? <laughs> Alright. Uh... What other inputs do you have? Shadow you, freeze you solid. Are you mocking me? Well, that's a special. Hold up. R1 while guarding. While guarding? Okay. Oh. Alright, give me, let me at least let me guard. Oh, wrong button. Shit. <laughs> oh. Does that do it from any distance? Hold up. Go ahead, shoot. Oh, wait. I need heat meter for that. And for some reason, it's not... I thought it was at... Oh. Max and infinite are two different things. What is the range on that? I'm trying to figure out the range on that one. Ow, Mista. This is on some Nato shit. That's a really fast grab, actually. <laughs> I was waiting for it. I was waiting for the breakdown, right? Okay, Mista, Mista, come the fuck down now. You're good. Stop shooting me. Uh, reset settings to default and thing. Yes. Wait, no. Wait, what? Yeah, I put my heat gauge back to normal. Fuck you. Now, what are your other abilities? This is your user mode and your stand mode. Ooh. Okay. Hmm.
Wait, I'm sorry, is that the same one as his regular? Oh yeah, it is, okay. So, lay off, one escape, and... Slide along. What the hell? One escape is that. What was layoff again? Okay, that's that's a hard knockdown. Oh, that's just like a Oh, okay. Yeah, it's just us him speeding up. Huh. That's pretty much it. Why icy gentle weeps? This is user mode. And we have other skills here. But you can get away from me. Ultra close. Uh, ultra close. Ultra cold temp temperature freeze. The moisture in the air. Jesus, that's so much. When downed in arrow K. What? Oh. It's backwards. Can, can you not, like, can you do the input? Thank you. That or when you're knocked down, so I guess you can do it as a reaction. Okay, that's cool. Shout to you. Da -da 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 -da. Any form, stop. Hmm. And then you have... Thought you could get away from me. Which is this. So you have the, uh... Yeah, you have the medium version, the heavy version, and the light version. Okay. Yeah, they're, they're definitely trying to make this, like, a more proper, um... Dude, I love how impatient he is. <laughs> A more proper like balanced fighting game because fucking in the original release it was just hectic what let's speak about how hectic it was right especially when you have uh, characters who can stop time for fucking nine whole seconds where the hell are you Dio where are you at Dio oh my god it's color-coded why am I having a hard time with this here he is I want to see if, I mean, they probably, I want to see two things, right? <coughs> I want to see if, I want to see if, uh, if Dio's thing still lasts nine seconds, and I want to see if fucking Diavolo's, like, time rewrite, rewrite, I can't say, his fucking bullshit, right? This is him doing his roll roller shit. <laughs> oh man, everybody loves Dio and Jotaro, but true JoJo fans know that part 3 is the worst part. Anyways, uh, <laughs> how many people did I just upset? Time stop, there it is. Come on, do your... Oh, what? I couldn't hit him in it? Oh, there wasn't that much damage. Remember, people used to do this shit all the time. And just ruin your fucking day. Eh, alright. So they, uh... They definitely nerfed the damage that would happen from that. Because I remember that doing a stupid amount of damage, right? So that got nerfed, that's fun. <laughs> and let me see if Diavolo's thing got fixed, right? Cause his whole thing is like, what? It only lasts for like, what, three or five seconds or something like that, like shorter, definitely shorter than nine. <laughs> 
definitely shorter than mine. Yvolo, go hang out with your daughter. I would have loved that they put like Highway Star in here. Or like some other part four characters. Like we have red hot chili pepper, but we don't have Oh, we're in the dinosaur village. But we don't have uh whatchamacallit? Oh. Oh his Oh, that's that's fun. I wonder, does that actually negate anything? Is that actually something that Diavolo can just straight up do? Like just dash through attacks? You can. You can. You can dash through attacks. You can dash through attacks. That's really fun, actually. <laughs> That's so stupid. I love it. Motherfucker tried to hit me. He tried to hit me from underground. You saw that? You saw that? Diavolo's gonna be fun. He's gonna be fun to fight against. That's that's amazing. Diavolo, the character who might have the worst uh the worst fate out of all of them, right? How do I grab again? Oh, it's a. Uh, there it is. Alright, Diavolo. King Crimson. It would have been fun if they put Dapio as a playable character. I mean, isn't his intro him being Dapio and turning into Diavolo? Let me see. Eliminated 0.5 seconds. Raising time. Ghost triggers automatically if it lands. The life is mine. What the f What? I'm sorry, what? A special mode that automatically activates whenever you execute, uh, exec, execute, wow, execute a star skill. A star skill? What? Eulogy? Wait, I'm sorry. <laughs> what? Wait, I'm confused. What's happening right now? Why? Oh, oh, I see. I see what's happening. I see what that is. Yeah, insta dodge. Does that go for as long as you want it to? If you have. Okay, that only goes for one full bar, though. Dude, Diavolo is going to be stupid to play against. And hella fun, man. People are going to hate you with that spot dodge bullshit. Untouchable. Untouchable. Right? Let's see. Time has been erased. And it has a star effect. In recent time. So erasing time is just, uh, it, it doesn't really need to be like, on there. <laughs> it can just be, you know, part of whatever, right? But how do I do that again? It's a, uh, no, not that. What is that? Is that an anti-air? How do I... Get back up. Huh. It might be an anti-air, I can't tell. It doesn't seem like I can combo into it. See. 
while taking damage. What? He has a lot of, like, counter shit. Oh, you're an asshole. <laughs> you're an asshole that you just waited for that. Turn to dinosaurs. How did that happen? It must be Diego's ability. What's it called? Scary monsters? Even though it's technically not his ability? Okay. No. I didn't mean to do that. Fuck. Also. Please, control guide, get away from me. I don't like looking at you. I don't need to know how how bad I am at this. Chargeable. Let's see. I know there's a way to to enter a certain state, and that's what I'm trying to do. Wait, what? Did I not? Oh. Oh, that's just like a... Yeah, that's just an overhead. Bro, passes timer sounds... Chargeable. What? Scary monsters, can you stop? How the fuck do I? The passage of time resumes. It's just like a hard hit. Like what? I don't. I'm a little confused as to. Did they get rid of one of his abilities? Stand mode. During the passage of time resumes. What? I'm confused as to what? I'm really confused. What the fuck? I'm sorry. Forward and backward. Am I not doing it correctly? As it's happening, right? Am I not? I'm so confused. Or alternately, during the passage of time resumes, your stand throws a powerful downward punch. Oh, oh, I am doing it. Okay. Can be activated the moment enemy attacks, but distance between you and your opponent, the skill nullifies the damage you have received from the attack and automatically triggers erase erasing time consuming two bars.
Okay. Which direction was that again? That's back. God, I fucking hate. I hate. Oh my god, scary monsters. Get the fuck out of here with your bullshit. I hate doing this input so much. I hate it. Am I not pressing the right button? Yeah, it's R1. While taking damage. So it doesn't even, it's not like a active like, like you don't go into a stance and get ready to get hit. You have to do it while getting hit. I'm trying to do it. I'm trying my best to do it right now. I really am. Like, it's a user ability. It's not a stand ability. And I keep summoning my fucking stand while doing it. Oh, there we go. See, that's what I was trying to do. Okay. Yeah, he used to... I could have sworn he used to have, like, an ability similar to Dio's. Where it gave him... Not a time stop, because it would slow down time a little bit. Right? Like, your enemy would be slowed for, like, three seconds. And you had, like, three seconds to, like, run in there and do whatever bullshit you wanted to do. But I guess they took that away from him. Yeah, I guess they took that away from him. Huh. So they didn't fix it, they just took it away. <laughs> I spent more time on Diavolo than I wanted to, honestly. I'm just having a lot of fun, like, looking at this and looking at all the changes. Right? Hmm. I want to see... Did they do... Well, let's see how... Let's see how Pesci and his Anaki does, right? Anaki! I just want to see how they control a bit. Right? Let's head to, uh... Let's turn the gimmicks off. Let's do that. Because it's going to fuck me over. Let's head to the prison. Man, season two is out. There's no way they're going to get to survive. Eh, they might get to Survivor. How about, how about you don't for a moment? How about... How about you just... You just stop for a moment? Okay. So you can still use his stand. Which... How... Hmm. I didn't think they would show it. <laughs> right? Okay. Oh man, that holds you for a bit, huh? And it lets you just... Yeah, okay. Can you... No, you can't. I was trying to see if you can, like, combo into anything else off of that. But it seems like you only got one thing. 
Oh, dogs are barking in my house. That's fun. How does the grab look? Smack him around. Reverse grab? How does that look? You just turn around and throw him? Alright, cool. Uh... Your gutless rat. When opponent is down... Well, hit him down then. Okay, just kicks on the ground. Okay, you can switch between those two freely. That's cool. Uh, Fisherman, we've seen that already. You feel the shock through the line. Now I'll reel you in during Fisherman. Really? Hold up. I'm assuming there's a... Is there not a heavy version? No. Huh. That's real you in. Okay. So switch sides. That's pretty cool. Rip you apart. Which I just did, right? Anti-air. Seems like an anti-air. Hook, line, and sinker. Oh, you can hold the trap. Okay. Nice try. Oh, that had that had good reach. Oh yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's nice. I like that. Uh, see so your movements are wide open. What? Is that like a command grab or what? What is that? I don't know. It's a. It's definitely a fucking um. Jesus, I wish there was a faster way to move that. It's definitely a uh, counter. Suck away your life. Oh, and it puts you at max for whatever the hell. Oh. What is that? Less speed. Less speed, less damage. What is that? I want to know what those effects are. Seem to put like some status effects on them for a bit. Hmm. Okay, in stand mode, age engage. A gauge that shows opponent's aging status. Status, status, status. Hitting with the star skill will raise the aging level. Hitting with your with your heat action, hyper heat action, whatever the fuck it's called, I don't know. We'll set it directly to level 3, which I did. Aging level will revert to 0. Gradually depletes when it's empty. Okay. Wait, so it's at 0 now, right? Oh. I see. And how long does that last? It's at max right now. Okay, yeah. That's... Okay. I'm a little confused. Wait. It went down to level 2, but then it went straight down to 0. I love how the computer is smart enough to, like, not attack me. Why doesn't that... Well, get the fuck out of here with that. That's not happening. Ooh. Come on. Why doesn't... I'm so confused. I guess the airplane's like a high attack and it doesn't really do much. Now, I want to see... It's at max, right? I'm gonna keep walking back just to like... Okay, it goes straight down to zero. I'm a little confused how that works. Honestly. Because I feel like it should be like level one, level two, and then like max. 
right? Something like that. Because I saw it hit level 2 at some point, but then it went straight to 0, so I'm, I'm a little confused as to how that works. Does volley of punches towards the ground. A mid-attack can be used to inflict additional attack to a downed opponent. Okay, let me see. Uh, The level will drop by 1 if, if you go down and drop to zero if the opponent hits with the with a great heat action. Okay. Depletes more slowly while the opponent moves or attacks. At level one, the stylish evades and the stylish guards are sealed. Ooh, okay. So perfect guards and perfect dodges are sealed. Level two, jumping is sealed. That's, that gotta suck. Level three, forward and backward steps are sealed. Oh, so they can't move. It just fucks with their movement options. Uh, and you can just fuck them up <laughs> at a distance. So weird. See. Direct contact's the fastest. Sorry, did I do that wrong? That's definitely a command grab. Okay. And now jumping is sealed, and then after that, you get to level three, and movement altogether is sealed. Huh. Okay. So it doesn't go down from max to level 2 to level 1. It just, like, the gauge shares with each level. You just build it up over... T okay. I see. That is... Interesting. Alright. Video is getting pretty long because <laughs> we're just taking a look at characters. We're not really doing anything crazy, you know. Not trying. I'm not trying to like be super cool and go like, look how cool I am with this game. No, I'm trying to just show off some characters that people will be interested in, but not showing off every single character because that would take too long. Um, let's get Foo Fighter a closer look because I really didn't do that justice. Actually. I wanted to see something real quick. If I go to practice, is it only 1v1 that you can do? Because I would love to like switch switch characters in the middle of the match. Uh, it doesn't really matter who my assist is, since I can't really switch. Let's have Ikaro here. I gotta read part 8. I gotta read part 8 myself, honestly. Cause dude just looks like a fucked up Jonathan Joestar. And I'm not- I'm pretty sh- like... Can that dude even like use like, Stan? He might just be a Stan himself. Alright. Let's see. Foo Fighters, Emergency Evade? Ooh, really? Oh, nice. Quick movement option, I like that free combination of, okay. Does that automatically go? Allows free combination of skills and one chain attack. A skill cannot be followed up with itself. Oh, so like... So what are you, like a Rekka character? <laughs> Lengthen actions, moves like FF, replenish and use. I've overcome my weakness or get or get weather or get weather forecast to make it rain. <laughs> weather forecast. Uh-huh. Yeah, okay. Definitely not weather report. Max of five uses. Wait. I'm a little confused as to what the hell that means. 
allow for a combination of star skills. Oh, of star skills. Wait. So what are... Ooh. Oh, okay. And you can do that up to five times, though. Oh, shit. And it's five times because you have, like, the krills right there. Alright. Now, how do you replenish that? Oh, that's so cool. How'd I do that? I like that. That's a that's a great overhead. Oh, that's so good. It has a good angle. Good cross-up. It looks like it's a cross-up. That's so good. I like that. I love you, Foo Fighters. Alright. Air okay. Oh, that's what I just did. Wait, it's air okay? Hold up. I just realized that. Ugh. How do I replenish my krill? My shrimps. <laughs> Get away from there, it's my water. Wait, what? How the fuck does that work? During a star skill, so... Wait, what? I'm confused as to how that... what? Fires a shot after flipping forward or backwards. The FF shot is high attack. Move forward, you are invincible to not throw attacks. Speed increases in that order, but the faster the movement, the more vulnerable you become. Mm. Oh, wait, it's plus a move. Okay, I'm sorry. I didn't even notice that. I thought it was just a... Uh... I'm guessing I need, like, a, a krill or some shit. How do I replenish that? Oh, that's how you do it. Ooh. <laughs> you just call in for fucking weather report to just go like... Also, again, the move's called tell weather forecast to make it rain, but you obviously hear her say weather report. <laughs> like, uh, but we have pet shop now instead of animal shop, so at least we won something, right? Oh, okay. Oh, that's how that works. Make it rain, bitch. Is that the only way to get it back, though? I'm being of superior intellect in you. Uh, I'll blow your head off your shoulders, air okay. In air. What? That's not it. Is it forward? Oh, it's forward. Okay. Wait, can I... Hold up. I want to see if I can... Damn it. Can I do that like... No, that's just FF shot. God. That's not a star. That's not a star move, is it? No, it's not. Okay, well, eh. What the hell is this? Oh, that's the, uh... That's the obvious anti-air. And there they go. That's his fucking fish hook. A man built like a pineapple. So FF doesn't have a. Oh, I see. Okay. Oh. Wait.
That's so fast. If that's that fast, then why would you need... Why would you ever need to use Weather Report? Absorb Water fully restore Plank Things being hit before the Drink animation in full effect will negate the entire move. Oh, so I'm guessing just doing this gives you invincibility. Contact water, weather forecast. Weather forecast. Uh, weather report via walkie-talkie. Make it rain, restoring health, and fully restoring health. It can't be by that much. Okay, well, since Foo Fighter is, like, basically a stan herself, all right? There's no, like, active stand switching, but you have the water. <laughs> hey, you, get away from my water! Uh, calm down, Foo Fighters! <laughs> FF, what are you doing? Alright, so Foo Fighter plays me and keep away. That's fun. I love you, Foo Fighters. You're amazing. Alright. These are basically just the same character, right? Actually, no, I think one of them has Stray Cat and the other one doesn't. I think this one has Stray Cat in it. And this one is just like, basic bitch, uh, Killer Queen. Like, without all the wonderful attachments and add-ons. <laughs> yeah, just take this cat plant, just put it in my gut. Alright, I wanna see... ...what they did to Johnny. Because Johnny is very interesting to me. <coughs> because in the original, like, no no pun intended, you would be very handicapped when playing as him because he is handicapped. He is a paraplegic. From the waist down. Ah! Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute, does playing as does playing as Johnny just automatically puts corpse parts in the fucking Even if my spin falters all them dies? Oh, wrong All User mode, mounted mode, user mode. Task acts one, two only. Okay, tuck me a, tuck me a second, right? I love how Koichi's in the background, right? He's trapped by the ghost. <laughs> the ghost has trapped him. So, if I collect the corpse part, right? Does that get me to act two? How do I, how do I grab it? How do I, how do I grab the corpse part? I'm still on Act 1 of Tusk. How do I get to Act 2? Give me the corpse part. Is it because I have... I already have, like, an arm? What is that, an arm or a leg? I don't know. Oh, you just go down on it. <laughs> you just go down on it. Yep, yeah, mm-hmm. Don't I have a, a action that lets me leap in the air? Oops, wrong button. That automatically put me to Act 4. <laughs> Spoilers for Part 7! Avert thy eyes! That automatically put me to Part 4. I didn't want to do that. Not Part 4, my bad. Act 4. I want to see... How you build that up. Okay, so I got one corpse part. There's another one where? Behind me? Where's the other corpse part? Oh. God damn it. My bad. I'm thinking it's like up and... I gotta be on the ground and pick it up. Okay, I have three corpse parts. How much are we gonna go up to? Five? I forgot the name of Johnny's horse. I know, I know, uh, Zapelli's is Valkyrie, right? 
have three corpse parts. Okay, so I guess we're only going up to three. So what does that do for me? Okay, I call them Tusk. You know, you can shoot his nails. Golden spin nail bullet. For Act 2. How do I switch between acts though? Tusk growth automatically activates when activating, even if my spin falters. Okay. Using a heat action once once to grow tusks. Your skin on one level. Tusk growth changes skills. You'll be able to use performing. Okay. Act four, regardless of its current level. Hmm. So how... I'm sorry. <laughs> we'll never falter. Wait, no, that's on horse, right? Okay, so that goes to Act 2. So now I have Act 2 of Tusk. How do I replenish my nails? Stan unleashes a barrage of punches. Only for three and four. Downs the opponent's your stand. Gross to test uh, to act four if it's at three. After launching your nails, your stand automatically searches for your opponent's location, teleports in front of them, unleashes a barrel of punches. Wait, what? Am I not pressing the right buttons? It's backwards? Oh, that's for... Oh, my bad. For Act 4. So I'm on Act 2 right now. So we have Golden Spin. Right? Okay. <laughs> and now we're on Act 3. I gotta move the fuck out the way. Oh, there's Okiyasu! There's a raven over there. I forgot what the raven does. Okay. User mode. Careful. Cursor for herbal tea. Oh, that replenishes your shit. Okay. Only for Act 2 and 4, though. So you gotta get to Act 2. Plus icon. Number of nail bullets. Proportion. After stand grows to toss two, ten shots will be displayed for both hands. Each shot causing one. When icons go dark, these bullets automatically restore after all ten have been fired. Okay, speed of restoration increases when... Oh! Incre okay, so... You just want to shoot these off, right? And they all just come back. I mean, is there a way to, like... Okay, they all come back like that. Okay. Is there a way to, like... Like, um... Combo into each of them? Fire towards the ground and hole send off. Yeah, we did that already. Did we? Right? I would assume there would be like attacks that take up like three nails at a time or something like that, right? Like maybe like a heavy version. Oh, heavy version goes super fast. Why wouldn't- why would you never do the heavy version? Pretty fast, right? Okay. 
Okay. Who will be sacrificed? That's Act 4. Act 3, which I'm at right now. Send me down the hole. Hmm. Only council would circle. Oh, that takes up two. How much is the heavy version? Oh, what? Wait. I'm sorry. I just had like a moment. Okay, so one activates it and the other one, but... And that one's just like kind of a faint, I guess? Hmm. They perform a circle of faint. Yeah, it is a faint. Okay. Attack does not take place. Circle can be used to cancel the attack midway if you want. Alright. How do I, uh, how do I, uh, what you call it? Upgrade my tusk again? Oh, act one only. Yeah, well, it's the same goddamn thing. You can do mounted and unmounted, right? Act two only. Oh, wait. So which one's the attack that changes it to four? Let me see. Chargeable who will be sacrificed. Act 4 only. Act 2 only. There was a there was a move that you can use that changes Act 3 to Act 4. Act 3 and 4, send me down the hole. Uh your arm disappears into the hole, blah 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 blah. Yeah, we just did that. Where's the upper half? Movement technique which puts your entire body into the hole using it to reappear to another location. This is all like early shit, <laughs> by the way. And like, uh... In part 7, right? I gotta be on the ground for that. Oh. Okay. And then this one's like a fake. Alright. See. Which move was it? Act two. You gotta do this when mounted? And this one, you can oh, oh! So this- Oh, so to get it to Act 4, you have to do it while mounted. Okay. And now we're at Act 4. So that's how you would naturally get it up there. Okay, and then Act 4 can do... The previous act can do... Okay, yeah. The higher acts can do the previous act's actions. Huh. So what, Johnny is mostly like keep away? Oh my god, that is a lot of damage. Okay, if I was on the horse and I wanted to get away, though, right? Didn't Johnny used to have, like, a leap ability that helps him get away? Where he's like, oh shit, I jumped, right? Well, I guess not. I guess they might have gotten rid of it.
So most of Johnny's movement options, right? Well, I feel like a good portion of his movement options is when he's off the horse. Okay. Well, at least the one that lets him, like, you know, kind of teleport around the stage a bit. Alright, well... Let's take another look at one more characters, because this is getting... This is a long video. <laughs> this is a long video! Right? Take a look at Diego Brando, because I actually never played as him in this game. And I want to know what exactly did they do for him. Spoilers for part 7, by the way. <coughs> Alright, Diego Brando. You bitch. What does the cork parts do, though? I still didn't get an answer to that. What, what do they actively do? I assume they, uh... He has mount mode and user mode, but he has a stand. Right, he can turn into scary monsters, right? You can do scary monsters holy corpse. Picking up holy corpse part that appears in the area provides you with the blessing. The effectiveness of the blessing increases according to the number of corpse parts you pick up. There are three stages of effectiveness. If you're down, you will drop a part and return to the previous stage. Stage 1 enables use of Are You Ready? Stage 2 increases the performance of a skill. Stage 3 increases the amount of which the gauge is replenished. Okay. Let's you use Are You Ready? What? Are You Ready? This one, this one is probably for his uh, dinosaur shit, right? Are You Ready? Square triangle during gorge. Wait. Oh, it just adds another one. Okay. Dinosaurs! Dinosaur kinetic vision. He just sends out a copy. Okay. Alright. Does he not get his, uh, his other thing? Spoilers. Huh. Okay. So he only, he only does scary monsters. He doesn't do his other thing that he gets. Hmm. Okay, user mode. Hesitate, speed supreme. He gets a lot of abilities off his horse. Kinetic vision after quickly pressing. What? After quickly pressing down, blah, 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 quick jump based movement technique. Wait, so I, I jump after? Oh, so it's just, okay, so it's just a jump. All right, it's like a super jump. Okay, cool. Frightening monsters. <laughs> Can't call it scary monsters. No, 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 no. Can't do that. Aerial chain in air. What? I think I, I think I need to have you jump in order for me to do that. Yeah.
I'm so confused. What the fuck? Aerial chain. Normal attacks. Can be combined into a chain beat in midair. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. But I can only get like two in. Oh, there we go. Okay. User mode dinosaur. How do I dinosaur? Wait. How do I dinosaur? How does one become dinosaur? How do I get on the floor? Frightening monsters. Oh, I thought I did that already. My bad. Oh, and it takes up a... Okay. It takes up a meter when you do that. Oh. So dinosaur mode... By the way, I need you to stop jumping for me. I need you to stop that. Yeah, you gotta stop. Dinosaur mode! Dinosaur! Above you. Okay. So dinosaur mode. Kinetic vision. Chop him up. You get a nice little Goomba stomp, right? And then you can summon more compies. Yeah, if you go dinosaur mode, you might as well just easy beat it, right? Because all the other extra shit you're gonna do. Right, you can already summon compies, like, beforehand. Go into it, right? Get in some hits. And then maybe get like one of those in. Oops, wrong button. I just want to see his mounted combat real quick. Yeah, it automatically yeah, it, it doesn't want him on the horse. <laughs> it doesn't want him on the horse. There's no reason to be on the horse. I mean it's just there for the sake of being there, I guess, but yeah. When the easy beat system is like, no. What can you do on the horse that's like any special? Your monsters, useless. Are you ready? Yeah, nothing. So, nothing that different. Because you can still do it here. Yeah, it wants you. It wants you off the horse. Diego doesn't want to be on his horse. Because that horse is useless to him. My horse is broken. <laughs> they broke my horse, damn it. Alright, I said I had time to look at one more, but I think I can squeeze a little bit more. Listen, we're playing JoJo. Shut up. If you don't like the video, you should have left by now. <laughs> have you seen my channel? It's not user friendly. Uh. I'm trying to see, like, who do I really want to, like, pick on. Anyone that, like, stands out to me. That's, like, very interesting. I guess Eremis, right? No, actually, I want to see what they do for Gyro. I know some people are probably like, like, uh, but I want to see, I want to see Josuke. You wanna see Josuke? Go read fucking... Go read part 8, motherfucker. I'm not spoiling it. Here, you can see him. There he is. Soft and wet. He's a sexy sailor. <coughs> Let's 
the sexy sailor man. Pie pie sailor man. Alright. Check out that mounted combat. Throwing balls in your face. Alright. See, you have your two steel balls that you got with the rotation. Alright. Ooh, and they come back. Hmm. Alright, so he can... He can throw them, you know, different distances, heavy, medium, you know, all that beautiful jazz. Spin. Ooh. Huh. See. Puts it in golden spin mode. Previous spin power from dropping or fixed period of time and increasing the performance of skills that you steal balls. However, you are not you will not be able to use spin while this mode is effective. I mean, duh, right? Steel ball icon, display how many steel balls are currently. Yeah, 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 we got that. Spin, spin, spin. Just did that. Scan. Oops, wrong button. Wait, no, right button. Wait, what? This is mounted mode. While you have a corpse part. Oh, corpse. Thank you. Because he does need a corpse part to get that. Oh, so that's the scam. So what is it? What, it, what does it do, though? Like maybe if I... What, what does it do? <laughs> what does it do? Right. Scan. Alright. Uh, a high attack cannot be detect, uh, cannot be deflected. Okay. Steel ball will fly as long as you continue pressing R1. When R1 is released, steel ball will float in the air for a fixed period of time. With the ball floats there, touching it will cause damage. And put okay. So. Alright. So he's mainly like kind of a trap character, right? One while run free. When downed. Well, I'm not doing that. <laughs> well, I'm not doing that. Right? Scarlet Overdrive. Oh, wait. Yeah, that's because I... Uh, wins, wins from Mexico. Oh, yeah. <laughs> At the beginning of... Uh, Steel ball run. He puts the, uh... He uses his cape as a sail. Fucking idiot. Alright. I'm sorry, what the fuck was that? I touched my skin. Does that make me, like... Hold up. Does that make me flatten? <laughs> Is that weird shit he does? If I do this, will I not get hit? Oh yeah, it toughens my skin. Do I still take damage? Hmm. I can't do it no more. It has a limit to it. has a limit to it, but what's the limit? What's the limit to that? Maintain consumes your gauge. Okay. Holy Corpse part. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Wait, is that it for Gyro? The rest is just like, the rest is just keep away. Spin, spin, scan. Hold attack to increase the distance of steel ball roll. Throw it away. Calm down. Calm down, Mr. Soft and Wet, okay? All right. How do I? Okay. Wait, if I hold it? Oh, it shoots the rocks up. That's what it does. Okay. It's kind of like a projectile. I mean, all of it is a projectile, right? So... Okay. That's pretty much it. Yeah, that's pretty much it for Gyro. Huh. Pretty tame. Gyro's stand is weird, because he has a stand technically, but the way stands work in Part 7 is fucking weird. There are some characters that have stands that are kind of like traditional stands, but then other characters that have stands, but you never really see their stands, and fucking some stands are just straight up items, like it's the fucking sword from goddamn Part 3. It's so weird. Part 7 is weird. Like, I don't think... I honestly don't even know if Gyro's stand has a name. Like, that's how weird it is. Right? Funny Valentine is weird. <laughs> He's the president of the United States. Spoilers, by the way. <laughs> Alright, well... That's it for, uh... Our nice little... Quick look at, uh, JoJo Bizarre Adventures. All-Star Battles R. Royal. Whatever the fuck you want to call it, right? Taking a look at the newer shit. Seeing how they kind of rework the game a bit. It's definitely, definitely seems way more balanced. Can't wait to see what they do for, um, for like the, uh, Seasons Pass and shit like that, right? I love JoJo. I love it so much, right? And then, of course, you got All-Star Battles, which is, you know, the closest thing to, like, a story mode you'll get, right? Is this one of the closest things to story mode you get, or is it arcade mode? No, yeah, no, this is the closest thing to... Wait. No. I don't remember this. I think this might be new. Or either or either it was like DLC or something like that. I don't remember. All-Star Battle. Arcade mode. No. Hey, look, it's part 5, Paul and the Ref. No, All-Star Battle was definitely a story mode. For some reason, though, I don't know why. Huh. I guess they changed how it worked? Because before you would... I, I could have sworn before you would click All-Star Battle and then it would take you to kind of like just... No, it wasn't even all -Star. I think it was literally just called Story Mode and then it would just take you to like not even a real Story Mode. They would just kind of show you some panels during a loading screen to tell you what the story was and then you would just go into a fight right with some conditions in it and that was pretty much it so i guess they changed that approach to it entirely right so i guess that's one thing that the ps3 version of the game still has that <laughs> that this doesn't right huh Interesting. Well, anyways, oh, I guess, I guess the PS3 version isn't completely useless now. Actually, it kind of is, because, I mean, it doesn't really matter, honestly. <coughs> it doesn't really matter. The story mode wasn't nothing fancy. There were, there weren't even cutscenes. Like, that's how, that's how incomplete the game was, right? Like, you only had the, you, like, the game was literally just a collector's item. And now it's not worth anything. I guess it technically might still be worth something, right? But it's definitely not worth like 200 bucks now, that's for sure. <laughs> Every time I buy a game, the value just goes down and down and down. Oh, man. But, yep. That's uh, All-Star Battle. That's what you're getting into. Here's your shop for like extra outfits and stuff. 
right? Shut up. I would have loved if they had, like, a Bakio playable. You like more character. Again, we got the season's pass, right? But, you know, the JoJo Glossary. Uh, Gallard Shop. Do the art voices, 3D models. Let's see. Oh, what? Just like 3D models to buy? I'm sorry. What? The Asian tattoo? The Asian. <laughs> Caesar normal. Lisa Lisa. Not ACDC. SC Desi. Wasn't there like outfits you can buy for these fucking characters? Am I wrong about this? Couldn't you buy like extra costumes for them? Customize? Let's see. Let you customize the following taunts, victory poses, and lines. Uh, metal lists you can buy if you mouse customize ones, unlock options to customize taunts, blah blah blah. So, edit character. Shut up, Darby. Let's head to Joe Taro, because everybody loves him so much. Yar Yar Days. Huh, no, there wasn't. Hmm. Wasn't there costumes for these fucking characters? Am I wrong about this? I could have sworn they were like. Give me a moment. You head to Versus, right? Head to Single Battle, right? Whatever, doesn't matter. We're not actually going to be playing a fucking match. Let's head to Jotaro because he's probably the one that has the most. No, actually, Josuke, let's head there. Yeah, you have outfits. Extra A. Wait, what the? The outfit doesn't even change. It's just it's just a color swap. So what's the point of this color swap? What? That doesn't make it doesn't make any fucking sense. doesn't make any sense <laughs> the Jojo glossary just in case you need to catch up on your Jojo that is new he was not he was not in the original he was not in the main use in the original that is 100% new the pillar men stands stands they each have their own ranges except for Jotaro's which at the beginning of part 3 it brings him a motorcycle somehow I don't fucking know <laughs> yep yeah, but that's Jojo right Hopefully you liked the video, nice little look into the characters and their system and shit and the rework and stuff like that, you know. I'm pretty sure a true fighting game fan would appreciate instantly going into the training mode <laughs> rather than just hitting the fucking verses, right? You know, checking out characters and shit. But, you know, if you didn't like the video, then why the fuck are you still watching it? I'm sorry that I wasn't able to entertain you, but apparently I entertained you enough for you to make it all the way to the end of this hour, almost two hour long video. So, uh, yeah, there, there's that. Um, <laughs> so, that's everything. Well, not everything, but that's mostly of what we're going to show you here. Since there's no real, like, story mode to this game, there's really no reason to do, like, a playthrough for it or anything like that. Maybe do a couple of videos here and there, you know, for, like, online battles, if, if I feel like it, right? So, uh, what else is there, right? In the description and stuff like that, I got a link to Twitch. I got playthroughs on my channel. Uh, if you're new to the channel, there's if you like Pokemon, there's the Pokemon Marathon. You know, going through a bunch of Pokemon games and stuff like that. Uh, real soon, going to be starting the Pokemon Crystal playthrough. And then after that, moving on to, like, you know, the more modern stuff, I guess. GBA and shit like that, right? Uh, what else is there? On Twitch just finished doing demon souls right just finished demon souls so next time i uh do a playthrough on twitch which is like next week or whatever gonna be playing batman arkham knight right play that on new game plus or whatever and you know i have a twitter and all that stuff all that fancy stuff you know if you're new to the channel and if you like it head to the twitch check it out uh like comment subscribe if you're subscribed, click the bell, all the other bullshit, 
this is an outro standard youtube outro everyone does it you know the deal if you don't know the deal well here's the deal click the bell button you get notified whenever a new video comes out and all that other bullshit right so uh, that's pretty much everything i need to say i need to say i want to say i have the energy to say all right so <laughs> hopefully you enjoy your jojo game right if you have the game hopefully you enjoy this video right and as always I want to say thank you for watching. I will see you in the next video, right? So stay happy, stay healthy, and take care. I'm a chef, chef too.